Hello everyone! Today, I'm going to share with you my version of Sinigang Samiso. I am using yellowfin fish. I'm using the tail and the head. Now, I'm heating up the pan and I will fry the fish. Let's pour in the oil. Enough for frying the fish. Then when the oil is hot already, we can put in the fish and fry until golden brown. Lalayo lang ako na konte kasi karga ko anak ko. Now, the pan is already hot and the oil, let's put in the fish. Yeah, parang sunog na. Later, to flip ko. Hi! After pong maluto ang ating fried fish, which is failed, medyo nag-ano-ano po yun, dumikit sa pan. Anyway, we're going to saute the sinigang sa miso. These are the ingredients. Fried fish, mustasa, mustasa leaves, um, pampaasim po, any kind of pampaasim. And since wala akong natural na sampalok, I'd, I'd rather use sinigang sa miso na ano, na instant but I prefer if you have kamyas or sampalak better um, what is this miso garlic onion and tomatoes I'm using two ripe tomatoes let's get started let's saute ayan mainit na ang pan then we're going to pour two tablespoons of oil that's my recommended. Two tablespoons of oil. And if the oil is already heat, is heating up, if it is already hot, then we can saute the garlic, then the onion, and the tomatoes. Make sure all are wilted. Para lumabas talaga yung natural flavor. Garlic. Then the onion. You some some prefer na onion muna mauna, but I prefer it to be yung bawang muna. I don't know why, but minsan try ko para hindi naging effective sa cooking style ko. So next are the tomatoes. Mm. Smells good. Okay, the tomatoes and then it will. So now wilted na yung tomatoes. Let's add the pepper. Then salt. Put it again. First. And add natin tong miso. Check nyo kung fresh yung miso. Kasi yung minsan, ito na yung amoy. So, uh, lalaman niyo naman kung fresh yung miso kung hindi pa foul yung odor. Stir, stir, and then we add water. Stir mga one cup of water. And then let's stir again. So, ibiblend natin yung miso sa water na nilagay natin. Ito ang magiging sabaw. Oops! My son is screaming. It's okay, kuya. Wait a while, mommy's cooking. Mommy's cooking, kuya. Kung nakita niyo yung ganyang consistency, medyo malapot, you add more water. Then, simmer. Cover. mixture. Now we are going to add yung sinigang sa miso or any pampaasin. Sinigang sa miso na, na sinigang mix pampaasin. Huwag masyado kapag meron kayong toddlers kasi mahirap na mga sumatang siya mag-acid reflux. 
I think ready nang ilagay ang ating leaves. Musta sa leaves? Makikita niyo naman kung luto na yung vegetable. Nag-iba yung kulay. So, bright green later, medyo pale na yung green. Pero maganda kung ano yun, half cook. But because I have toddlers, they cannot tolerate yung half cook na veg vegetable as of the moment. So, stir natin to. If you know na yung sabaw ay kulang, just add water. Then, mamaya naman, i-adjust yung taste nun kung kulang ang asim. Dagdagan ng pampaasim. Kung kulang as ang alat, you dash a little bit of salt, etc. And then, we are going to cover this and simmer until yung leaves ay lutong na. focus. So, ayan na. Ito na. Lalagyan na natin ang star ng ating meal. Pero bago yan, let's taste first para maging perfect ang ating all over presentation ng ating pagkain. So, stir mo na. And then, we're going to taste. Taste ko nga. Mmm, nice. Tama-tama lang yung asim. But if you like yung mas maasim, you can add more. By now, I'm going to add a dash of salt kasi medyo tumabang. And, ito na po. Ilagyan na po natin ang bida. So, sorry lang ah, medyo fail yung aking pagprito. I don't know why there's something in the in this fish parang hindi ko gamay ang pagluto ng yellow fin taste ko nga ulit nice good we're going to add our fish That's it guys. Thank you for watching and I hope you'll be able to try my version of Sinigang Samiso using yellow fin. Please subscribe po and like and share my recipe. Good day!